All right, so this is review, all right? Um, we have overrated. When something is overrated, it's like you have a higher opinion than what something really deserves or someone deserves, okay? So we went through this um, as a joke. You know, BMWs are overrated, at least in Korea, because you know, they catch on fire, right? So I think um, for gas, they call it Halebu or something. And what is more flammable than Halebu? BMW, right? Or BMW, uh, however you will pronounce it for it to rhyme, okay? That's a Hyundai joke, all right? So all of you working at Hyundai, this is a Hyundai joke. Okay, anyway, ha ha ha. Okay, now we have underrated, Underrated is overrated, but the opposite, right? You have a lower opinion of something when it deserves to have a higher opinion, you know? Um, like 10 years ago or 20 years ago, Hyundai cars were underrated, but they're now they're, they're just much better, right? Um, so yeah, that's overrated, underrated, okay? Here you have cut me some slack. Okay, that means take it easy on me, all right? Cut me some slack. So maybe your boss gave you a lot of work or someone's giving you a tough time and, you know, you tell them, hey, cut me some slack. All right, don't be so hard on me. Take it easy on me. Um, so slack. Well, the term slack, like if you say I'm a slacker, um, you know, I like to slack a lot. That means I like to be lazy. I'm a slack. I'm a lazy person. So maybe that's what that is. Cut me some slack. Cut me some laziness, you know, give me a break, right? Like that. Um, bite the bullet. When you bite the bullet, you pretty much, you do something you don't want to do. Okay. That's bite the bullet. So <clears throat> I don't know, like. For example, maybe I know everybody loves doing work, but your manager comes up with a new assignment and someone in the team has to do it, right? So you decide to bite the bullet and do something you don't want to do. And sometimes you bite the bullet because there's no other choice, okay? You can't avoid it, so you just got to do it. Get out of hand. When something gets out of hand, it's out of control, okay? You know, if something is in your hand, you can control it with your hand. But it is, it, but it is out of your hand. It is out of control, all right? So here are some hardcore street expressions, okay? Go hard or die trying, all right? Go hard or go home, okay? Um, so, you know... People say this on the streets, but also people say this in sports, all right? Uh, you're on the football team, MMA, wrestling, you know, something with hard physical activity. Your coach will say, hey, go hard or die trying, right? Go 100%, do your very best. Or, you know, to, to get that strap. The strap means championship belt, right? Get that strap, get that championship belt or die in the process of getting that championship belt. Okay, like that. Oh, dog leash. Dog leash is, uh, you know, a guy's in a relationship and his girlfriend has him in check. She has the power in the relationship. She has a dog leash around him. Ooh, tough times. <laughs> All right. Uh, he wants me to give him my smartphone. Yes, that's right. Children will want your smartphones, okay? Here, um, let's go with this one. Think outside the box, all right? Ooh, that's scary because outside is inside of a box, but, you know, that's the lights. But anyway, ooh, scary stuff right there. All right, so think outside the box is you got to think beyond what normal people think, okay? Normal people, they think inside the box, but you want to think outside the box, right? In other words, when you think inside the box, you say, it can't be done. I can't do it. When you think outside the box, you're like, how can it be done? How can I do it? Right? You're starting to think outside. Like, okay, there's a way. 
How do I do it? And there's, oh, well, actually, there's a couple more, I think. Um, but anyway, there's my way or the highway. When you say my way or the highway, you're telling them, look, you're going to do it the way I want to do it or you're going to get out. All right, go home, go away, get out of the, get out of the group, okay? Hit the road, hit the streets, all right? It's my way. We're going to do it the way I want to do it or you're going to the highway, my way or the highway. That's pretty tough. Uh, what do you do? Oh, uh, yeah. What do you do is like... What do you do for a living, right? If I say, hey, what do you do? That means, hey, what's your job, all right? Here's can't teach an old dog new tricks, okay? And this is kind of true, right? Old people, it's hard to teach them to do something new, right? They're stuck in their ways. And, you know, the older we get, we kind of, we see ourselves in the same situation, right? So that's the expression. You know, old people, they're stubborn, they don't change, okay? It doesn't matter if the sky is blue. If they think the sky is gray and they're old, you're not going to change them. They're going to tell you it's gray, all right? Like that. But then maybe they're colorblind. But anyway, that's another that's another story. All right, so yeah, that's can't teach can't teach an old dog new tricks. All right.